Hello there guys, welcome to Don't Be Serious. Today is video 2 of the Golden Headband. If you haven't watched my first video of the Golden Headband, please also check out that video later. I talk about the meaning and backstory of Sun Wukong's headband that you definitely don't want to miss before playing Black Myth Wukong. Now let's talk about the headband. I got something new to share with you. At the end of the trailer, the Golden Headband landed on the ground, revealing intricate patterns engraved on the surface. The patterns include three elements, main body features, the sea waves and clips pattern, depicting the surging and tumultuous momentum of the waves. The front has Cheung Wan, a species cloud patterns, symbolizing step-by-step -step ascension, a traditional Chinese motif that has persisted throughout China's history. At the junction, there is a lotus pattern, symbolizing beauty and the ideal personality of a gentleman, as well as the common people's prayers. Sea waves represents the sea, while cloud referring to heaven. The combination of these three patterns on the headband implies an allegory of intruding the East Sea rather than the celestial palace, but ultimately attaining enlightenment and coming a Buddha under the lotus. These three patterns correspond to three key stories arcs in the novel. Sun Wukong is seizing weapons from the Long Palace in the East Sea, causing havoc in the Celestial Palace, and finally converting to Buddhism after the Great Journey. They also represent the different psychological stages of the Monkey King's transformation from rebelliousness to self cultivation I believe the old monkey who picks up the headband here is the same one who first appeared in the very first trailer in the 2020. The player beats on his chest are consistent with those of the old monkey telling the story in the 2020 teaser. But there are differences in the position of the sash, the waist of the clothing, and the details of the hair. It's very likely that the developers have updated the old monkey's model, adding some new hair features, changing the face details, and so on. After all, it is normal for the game production team to make modifications to old models over the years. The circus patterns are intriguing, so is the original story. If you want to know the full background of this headband, what it does, what power does it hold, and how it was linked to Sun Wukong, please check out my video number one of the Golden Headband. And it is the end of the video. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Goodbye. Thank you for watching to the end. If you like it, please also check out my special shop. Don't be serious with gallery. Dot my shop dot com, where you can find all kinds of Sun Wukong t-shirt, coffee mugs, and many other interesting content.